everybody, this is Eric Warrior, and welcome to NetworkMarketingPro.com. I'm here in front of the Black Sea. If you haven't seen it, it's absolutely beautiful. You got to check it out. Beautiful fall day, the sun is shining. Um, anyway, it's a beautiful part of the world here in the Ukraine. But last week, we went through this five day exercise of this process, this four step process of prospecting. If I would you. And when could you do it for sure? So if I called you after that, you've done it for sure, right? And then, okay, what's the best number and time for me to call? Uh, really important. And a lot of people have asked, okay, I've done that. Now what do I do when I call them back? Here's what you do. There's one of two things that can happen when you call them back. You call them. First of all, one of three things, I guess. If they don't answer, then you leave a message that says, I'm calling you back as you instructed at this time and at this number. Please get back to me right away. Just leave it at that. Very simple. You're just being the professional one by following up. Um, if, they, if you talk to them, once you get them on the phone, they've either watched the, the video or done whatever uh, uh, assignment that you've given them. Watched the video, tried the product, read the magazine, visited the link, whatever it is. Um, either they've done it or they haven't. So if they haven't done it, you get them on the phone and they say, you know, hey, look, I just didn't have the time to be able to get that done. Don't argue with them. Don't say, hey, you said you'd do it. All you say is, look, I understand. Life gets in the way sometimes. Just let me know when you can do it for sure, for sure. Let's just set up a time for sure so we don't waste your time and we don't waste mine. And then you again, you go through the second, third, and fourth part of that process, which is getting the time that they're gonna gonna do the action, asking them that, that if you call them after that time, they'll have done it for sure, and then setting another time for you to be able to talk to them. That's it. If they haven't done it, you do that. If they have done it, then you just guide them to whatever the next step is appropriate. You just, what I do, if it's a DVD, I just say, look, did it make sense to you? Yes, it did. Well, do you have any questions about what you saw? Usually they will. And then just guide them to the next action. You can either say, well, look, let me get you on the phone with somebody who can help answer a question. Or let me get you some of the product or service so you can sample the product or service. Or any number of things. Um, have them visit a link. Have them listen to a conference call. Uh, invite them to a local event, get together with them for coffee, uh, send them a link that will explain some other part of your, your company, your product or service. Just take them to the next exposure. That's all that you do. So if they haven't done it, find out if they can do it for sure, for sure, and when, and set up the time to follow up. If they have done it, set up that next exposure and make sure that the time for that next exposure is very specific. We'll talk about uh, the importance of exposure to exposure later on in this week. Um, so hopefully that helps you when it comes to the follow-up. So ladies and gentlemen, my wish for you is that you decide to become a network marketing professional, that you decide to go pro. Here from the Black Sea, it's a fact that we have a better way. Now let's go tell the world. Everybody, sorry for the wind, sorry for the craziness, but take a look at this incredible view, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.